Hello YouTubers, Guitarman3YT here and the day has finally come that I finished my Jackson Charvel project. Woohoo! It's been since probably the beginning of summer, into May, something like that when I started it. And here it is all a week before Thanksgiving. I got it all put together, stringed up, wired up. Everything works great and I just want to do a review of it. This is my Charvel replica made out of a Jackson Dinky JS11. Let's take a look. Okay, here it is. It's no longer a Jackson Dinky JS11. It is my Charvel. The replica of a Charvel. I'd never try to sell it as a Charvel or nothing like that. I just wanted, I used to, my Charvel that I had back in the 80s was my favorite guitar and I miss it so bad. And I wanted another one. And I built this one for me and I'm going to keep it. So as you can see, it's got the EMG 8185s. It's got GraphTech Tusk saddles. A GraphTech black nut it's got the old school 1980 something Grover tuners with the little bean they call it bean uh, bean knobs I guess oh. <laughs> and it's got my the plate that I ordered I ordered a Charvel plate that's blank with no serial number, so I put my own little thing in there. And the only things that I reused from the Jackson are this claw here that's made out of brass or copper. This big heavy duty block. I use the same springs. I use the strap holder because they're nice and big. Those things are huge. They hold the strap really good. I use the black pickup rings from the Jackson, the base plate of the trim low, the Jackson knobs, and the switch. Everything else is all new. All the electronics, the pots, capacitor, the output jack. That's all new along with the pickups. And my faked tiger strap plain maple top. All right, well, in a minute here, I'm gonna hook it up and let's hear how it sounds. <laughs> Thank you. 